make me a believer in ODG. Last three rounds. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> that time I heard it. That sounded so fucking cool. <laughs> and it, it did a headshot on the second one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dang, dude. I kind of want the stag. <laughs> I love this gun. What's going on guys? Today we are talking about the Stag Arm Spectrum or the Special Tactical Rifle Makeup. And I believe Stag has done a really good job of bringing a lot of different companies together to make this a awesome rifle. But first, when you see this thing right out of the box guys, it is definitely staying true to what they said on the website and holding that 50 shades of OD green here. So your Spectrum is a limited edition rifle, and they do come in three different colors. You have OD Green, just like this, FDE, and Wolf Gray. Each one is limited to 500 pieces, and we have been told that they come in both the left-handed and right-handed ejection ports. So even our buddy Charles has the opportunity to get him a nice uh, limited edition stag. Definite looker of a rifle here. And these things are only being sold in store. So if you guys are looking for a limited edition rifle, you probably are going to have to ask your dealer to get this in for you. Uh, but let's break down this rifle. You know, starting from the beginning here, we have a Reardon SPB brake. And you will notice that this brake is unlike the entire rifle itself. It has this nice little purple and gold patina going for it. And it really does kind of just add that little extra vibe on the end of this rifle. Uh, but Reardon is a good company, guys. You have several different options with that company. And I know Reardon makes a hub that you could use with other suppressors. So you may have a suppressor at home that all you have to buy is a new hub for it. And you may be able to go ahead and put that suppressor that you have on this brake. So, you know, check with Reardon. Check with... Uh, stag to see if you're compatible but that may be an option for you coming back off the break guys we have a ballistic advantage lightweight hansen barrel i myself have a couple of ballistic advantage barrels and i've always been very impressed with these things um i believe this is holding true to what my experience has uh, held for me so far and it is a very accurate and very uh lightweight barrel just like it advertises and one thing that kind of caught my attention was that the lightweightness 
it's not really that noticeable. It is not like the lightweight barrels I've seen in the past where a lot of the surface is actually shaved off. This almost is as thick as a regular barrel, but you can tell that it does not have very much weight to it when you're actually holding it in your hand. Covering this barrel up, we have a about a 15 and a half inch M-lock rail here. And this is gonna give you guys plenty of real estate to put any of your accessories from your lights, your lasers, uh, your iron sights and all the above. You guys are gonna have plenty of space to do all of that. Moving back guys, we've got a nitrate BCG, an ambidextrous charging handle here and a ambidextrous safety as well. Now, one thing we should say is it's not a true ambidextrous rifle because you do have uh, just the safety and the charging handle. We are missing the strong side bolt catch release or the weak side or left-handed side uh, mag release. So it's about a half ambi here, but that is got the main thing that you need. I put an ambi safety on every rifle I have. So at least they definitely uh, have that on there for us. And this trigger is phenomenally light, guys. I know before we even got this thing to the range, our buddy Jay was talking about how light it was and how he could barely feel the reset just by dry firing it at home. And he was not joking. When you get this thing on the range, it is so easy to get some follow-up shots in. It just seems like it doesn't move hardly at all. And it's very easy to pick up that follow-up shot and get those really quick split times with this thing. We also threw in our OD uh, anodized Duramag for this video because I think that was just that little extra topping too to set this thing off. Your rifle will come with a Lancer mag and the Lancer mag will be of the color of your rifle. So the this one did come with the OD green Lancer mag in the box. We went ahead and threw a primary arms prism on this for the video guys. This was a great optic to run. Uh, this is my first prism review, so that did take a little bit of time to get used to because it is different than just your regular old-fashioned red dot. Uh, but it was nice having that little bit of extra uh, zoom out there on the range and picked up that 250-yard shot with this thing very, very easily. So I'm a believer, guys. Stag has done a, a couple of things to me. They have helped me get... Uh, changed my mind on green rifles uh i haven't really ever considered getting a green rifle before but i believe this was a great mixture of the colors like we talked about and i believe this is something i could absolutely have in my arsenal um, and be able to look at a lot of times without getting tired of it so good job stag i think uh everybody's gonna like these rifles when they get these things in their hands you guys have given them plenty of options to uh, deck this thing out and already taking care of a lot of the expensive and just kind of uh, you know nitpicky upgrades that a lot of people do anyway these days so you know from being suppressor ready a competition style trigger and almost half ambidextrous I think you guys have came out swinging with these limited edition rifles and I'm excited to see what else is in the stag line in the future so <laughs> That's it, guys. We appreciate Stag for sending this to us over here at GunMade, guys. We have really had a good time with this rifle. We have put 500 rounds through this thing with not a single issue. Almost every single round was suppressed, and this thing ate every single thing we could throw at it. We shot a lot of steel cased ammo as well as a lot of brass. Pretty much just your standard 55 grain boat tail stuff, but I think we did have... Uh, you know, about 10 different people be able to get their hands on this rifle and everybody agreed that it is definitely Ooh. something that at least you should try to, to get your hands on and shoot at the range if you can. So, so yeah, guys, that's it from us here at GunMade. Big shout out to Stag Arms for sending this rifle to us to review. We really appreciate being able to get our hands on it and be able to get this video out. Uh, it was an absolute dream to shoot, took everything that we could throw at it, and I believe you're going to have a lot of happy customers when they get these in their hands. Guys, thank you for watching. If you like what you saw, hit that subscribe button and share it with your friends, and we're looking forward to seeing you in the next video.